Uh, the next question is the top ten. I would top ten things I would recommend if you get a petrodom. Yeah, I don't know if I uh, will make it to ten. I will only uh, do so if I have good reasons. So I'm not going to make it to ten if it's not there. But first, you should be uh, have a <laughs> have the opportunity to care for the petrodom. Eh? So give it the exercise, walk it uh, daily. So you should have. Uh, some shoots that you can walk on, but also if even if you have to do it barefoot, it doesn't matter as long as the dog gets its uh, exercise. Two, in my opinion, should they get a good collar. So I would recommend a white collar. White collar puts a le little bit less st stress on the neck, or you could have a harness, but I like to have a good collar as well as a main attribute. The additional benefit of a white collar is that you protect the veins in the and the arteries in the neck a little bit better if another dog tries to bite it and that's oftentimes the main cause of uh, bleeding to death or the, being the ribs and uh, stomach being crushed or ripped open. The other thing I would recommend is to get a breaking stick and why? Uh, if your uh, terrier is reluctant to let loose, sometimes they do, it's good that you have an option to quickly separate them. So I would recommend to, to have that. When you start to have a pup, I would recommend to have a crate. To uh, this will help to make it, uh, yeah, make it less uh, messier, so that it will learn that this is this is his place, and also that will help to um, limit the times that it will be able to soil the place if they are not uh, yet bro housebroken. Another benefit of the crate is that you can put it away if you if the dog is too hyper or something or someone brings another pet or whatever and you can just put it away somewhere that it is not able to see the pet but also not able to reach those other people. Another thing that I would recommend is a police line. This is a type of line that you can attach for example to the collar or the harness and that you can adjust on different ways so it has different rings where you can place the you know, or can reconfigure the line in. It's not a must-have, but it uh, could be handy. I would also recommend that you get good food boils and uh, and water boils. I uh, use stainless steel myself because I think that's the best way to do it. But it can help that you keep uh, things uh, tidy. Um, then you have like six things already. I will, good chewing toys to give them a good exercise. I would recommend a Kong or a Nyla bone that are good toys. And they are very sturdy. Kong ball is also a very nice thing to have, so some toys could help. And uh, yeah, I will make it to seven, but those are seven good points, I think.